Good morning, everybody. This is Mary with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash this up button and be notified for future readings. This is a free general collective reading. Top suicide, everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with you and leave the rest. Uh, this is Daily Tea. It's a little different than my other readings. It's a more general current pulling of the energy. It's supposed to resonate 24 to 72 hours out from the time that you view it. However, everyone's on a different time and life path. So for some of you guys, it could resonate outside the 72-hour time frame. Um, thanks, everybody, for all the love and support to the channel. We're at 11,335 subscribers right now. So thanks so much for all the love and support to the channel. Help support a single mama uh, of two kids and an income stream. So thanks so much for all the love and support to the channel. Okay, so... Um, it's a very interesting channel this morning. Um, hopefully, I'm not. Hopefully, it won't be too long. I'm just saying. Um, but yeah, so we're gonna do it. Hope everybody is doing well. Um, if anybody didn't watch one of the readings last night, I just want to say this real quick. Someone contacted me last night, one of my lovely subscribers, and notified me that there were several cameras that um, this person had found in their living space yesterday. Um, so if somebody, if you guys feel the need to maybe do a sweep of your home and if you feel you need to, I'm not telling you to do it. Um, I'm just letting you know that someone in the universe has recently, as of yesterday, found hidden cameras in their home. So, um, you know, if somebody, if you guys feel you might want to do a sweep of your home, uh, with hidden camera detector or something of that nature, um, I'm just letting you know somebody found hidden cameras in their house. That's all. Okay, so um, free journal collective reading. Okay, so the channel message I received was um, a secretly homosexual masculine energy in the closet, I heard. Has been blackmailed, um, has been blackmailed to... Um, perform prostitution services for another masculine energy. And I heard one of these masculine energies is a police officer. Um, however, through many, and they've been making very good money off of it. However, through many series of chain events, um, this, these relationships are about to be exposed and the one, and the police officer that's been blackmailing the, um, masculine energy for sexual services um many negative series of chain events is about to happen for that officer so you plug it in how it resonates this is um this is strong so you plug it in however it resonates so it sounds like it's at least two um masculine energies in the universe blackmailing it sounds like it's two masculine energies in the universe However, this plugs in your life, it can be yours, my you're connected to, but somebody in the universe, masculine energies, are blackmailing other masculine energies for homosexual sexual services, basically. So, prostitution services on the homosexual end. Um, so, like in the closet, very secret. And I just want to disclaimer this I do not. I am not, do not discriminate against the LGBTQLA community when I'm saying this. Um, this is somebody's life out there. Um, I am not discriminatory discriminatory against any LGBTQLA people ever. Um, I just want to make that very abundantly clear. Absolutely not. I support the LGBTQLA community. Absolutely. However, this is wrong. I just want to say that. This is wrong. It's wrong. Um, it's wrong. <laughs> so, I mean, as much as I support the LGBTQLA community, I mean, my daughter is part of the LGBTQ, LGBTQLA community. Um, so me putting this out there is not discriminating against that community. I just want to make that clear. This is somebody's life and what they're doing is wrong, whether you're straight or not. Um, and I'm serious, but it's two masculine energies that are cells like they're secretly in the closet. So secretly homosexual. So for some reason, they're not coming out and saying in the public, it sounds like they want to be known as straight or that's what it sounds like. 
Uh, I'm serious because there's a reason they're in the closet. They don't want to be known. Uh, that is very, very secret. One, they're paying for um, sexual services. So they're paying for prostitution services from another man. Um, and two, um, it sounds like there, it's like in the closet urges, in the closet fantasies, in the closet stuff. Very, very secret. They just don't want the public to know. One of them is a police officer, I heard. One is a masculine police officer. Another one is not, it sounds like. Whatever they are, I didn't hear what they were. But one is a masculine police officer that's blackmailing this other masculine energy. It sounds like the masculine police officer is paying this other masculine energy for um, sexual services on the homosexual end. It's, it sounds like kind of like, um, uh, what is it, uh, gay for pay or, yeah, gay for pay is what it sounds like. But um, you plug it in how it resonates. But, um, but yeah, so... So one's a masculine police officer doing this. One is not, a, one's a masculine officer, not a police officer doing this. But they're black, I don't know if it's the same masculine energy they're blackmailing. It sounds like the other, there's three people, it sounds like in here, at least in the universe. One's a masculine police officer paying for prostitution services to a masculine energy. Very secret behind the scenes. Another one is not a, uh, not a police officer, but it's a masculine energy paying for prostitution services homosexual prostitution services to another masculine energy very secret behind the scenes i heard however um many shocking series of shame events are about to occur and the situation's about to be exposed so it's um it's about to be exposed and somehow the situation with the masculine police officer secretly in the closet masculine police officer many negative series of chain events is going to occur with him so i don't know if this situation is about to be exposed um because there's at least two masculines doing this in the universe but he's very significant this masculine secretly gay police officer that's been paid it sounds like he's been paying this masculine officer for i mean not officer this person doesn't sound like an officer this person is paying this masculine energy it sounds like he's the one being paid um but being blackmailed to be paid. So he's they're, they're blackmailing this masculine energy um, to, you know, ha have sexual intercourse with them, have sexual services with them, but this person can't say anything, basically. It sounds like this person cannot say anything, um, but they're getting paid to do it, basically. Um, but somehow the situation is about to be exposed. It is about to be blown open. Someone highly intuitive is getting wind of this. It is about to be blown open. Someone highly intuitive is getting wind of this. Oh my goodness. So it's about to be blown open. Some kind of gay for pay for play S type energy. Um, it's about to be blown open. Someone's getting wind of this. Um, now, I'm assuming these people do not live in Reno, Nevada, or anywhere where it is legal for prostitution to occur. Um, if these people reside in the United, the United States, these people might reside in another country. I didn't hear locations on this. So, you plug it in how it resonates, but I'm presuming it is not in a place where prostitution is legal. Um, and somehow, someone highly intuitive, so you might be the highly intuitive person, getting wind of this situation um, and somehow this officer masculine secretly homosexual officer like officer of the law i feel like police officer energy um that's been paying and blackmailing this masculine energy for sexual prostitution services something sounds like something very negatively and bad is about to happen to him um so you plug it in how it resonates now, i didn't hear what was going to happen to him that was negative and bad but something negative and bad is about to happen to him. But it sounds like he's been black. I mean, yes, he's paying for sexual services from this person, but he's blackmailing the hell out of this person too. So um, you plug in and how it resonates. This is terrible. This is terrible. This is terrible. It's terrible. I, I mean, I don't. Why you are in the closet? You're either, you're either gay. Uh, you're either gay or you're not. 
and like I said, I do not discriminate against anybody gay. My daughter is gay, and she's very happily gay, and I've always have supported her for four years now. Um, I am not gay. Um, you either are or you aren't, you know? I mean, and that's the truth. Or you are in the closet, um, and that's the truth. That's like the three categories. Um, you either choose to be in the closet or you choose to come out loud and proud. But however this resonates, um, some, something, I heard it's about to be blown open. And there's a very highly intuitive person about to get wind of this situation. So I don't know if somebody's investigating these people. Maybe highly intuitive person, because you're insignificant in here too. Maybe you're investigating these people, possibly. Um, you plug it in how it resonates. Wow. Spirit messages you have like this. Poverty. House. Number 37 or 20 could be very significant numbers in one's life. 37 or 20. Um, it could be a possible age of you or somebody you're connected to. Possible lottery number. Possible date of birth number. Possible green card number. Possible um, jersey number. Possible um, lottery number. 37 or 20. Poverty. A very secret behind the scenes shysty plan of the past really backfired on these people. Especially the masculine energy being blackmailed to perform prostitution services. It's going to continue to backfire and there definitely is someone investigating these people. Oh my goodness. Oh, so that, that's confirmation in the universe. There is definitely somebody investigating these people. So I think, of course, there's like 11,335 of you guys on here. So I think maybe one of you guys might be investigating these people, possibly. Um, but somebody is, whether it's one of my subscribers or not, somebody is investigating these people. Um, I heard a very chasey secret behind the scenes plan of the past has severely backfired um, on these people, um, especially the one that's being blackmailed for like gay for play um, energy over here, this person. Um, it sounds like this person was making money and probably a hell of a lot of money off this secret shy behind the scenes plan of the past. Um, it sounds like very street uh, secret behind the scenes shy plan of the past, um, but it is severely backfired on this person. So that's probably why they're being blackmailed. I think these people knew about the very shifty behind the scenes nasty plan of the past. Um, maybe they were in on it or participated in it, but this person sounds like they were making the money off it, but these people knew about it. So that's, I think that's why they're blackmailing this person for like gay for play energy um, now because now it's backfired on this person when they once were making a lot of money off of it they can't make money off of it so now these people are using this person for sexual services and blackmailing them not to say anything because now they know they need the money it's like the energy shifted someone is getting a huge 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 wake-up call oh my god i heard someone's getting a huge 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 wake-up call i'm serious that's exactly the energy i'm feeling here it's exactly in the energy I'm feeling. And it kind of reminds me of like Secret 7S type energy. And I didn't hear Secret 7, but it kind of reminds me of that. Because uh, a lot of the core members of the Secret 7 were secretly in the closet. A lot of the males were. They were secretly in the closet. And a lot of them did it with each other. Um, masculine and feminine. But, I mean, I'm just serious. They did. Um, so... Now they can't feed off single mom Leo and her children anymore. So if it is Secret 7, I'm not saying it is. But if it is, so now they might be prostituting them all, their own selves out, possibly. If it goes Secret 7. If it doesn't, it doesn't. You only plug it in wherever it resonates for you. 
But but I'm serious. So I feel it could go that way. But you plug it in how it resonates. But anyways, however that resonates, this masculine energy needs money. They need money. Um, there's whatever, whether a secret seven strategy plan of the past or some other plan of the past, street side as secret seven strategy plan of the past that has severely backfired that they were one, this person was once making a lot of money off of it. They can't do it no more. Now they're in poverty. So now other people that knew about their plan, secretly gay, um, homosexual individuals, um, they're blackmailing this person to use their body to give them sexual services. Now, yes, they are paying them for it, but still. So this person was um, is in poverty or needs money or something of that nature. We're pulling the poverty card, but they need money. They need money, basically. Um, and these people are blackmailing this person for, for gay for play as type energy for money, basically. Um, one of them is an officer. I heard an officer of the law. So you plug it in, how it resonates. Wow, we have house of right. Air sign energy and fire sign energy. Heavy Aries, heavy Gemini. Air sign energy and fire sign energy, heavy um, Aries and heavy Gemini is what I heard. So, um, heavy air sign energy, heavy fire sign energy, um, heavy Aries and Gemini. So, I feel heavy Aries and Gemini. So, I feel at least one of these people has heavy Gemini placements in their chart in some shape, form, or fashion. Um, two plus placements of Gemini in their chart because I heard heavy Gemini. So that's two plus placements of Gemini in their chart. They could have Gemini in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, North Node, Midhaven, or Jupiter. At least one of these people. Um, and heavy Aries. So at least one of these people, whether it's the officer of the law paying this masculine energy um, for some kind of behind the scenes, gay for play as type energy or not. Um, they could have Aries in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, North Node, Midhaven, or Jupiter chart, masculine energy. Um, so you play it in how it resonates. We at least got three people in here. And then we have the highly intuitive person that's onto their ass. So I think one of you guys might be the highly intuitive person that's on their ass. I heard there is definitely an, um, somebody is definitely investigating them. So I feel you, um, you might have Gemini or Aries in your chart too, possibly investigator person. You have only, you know, your story, not anybody else. So you have to plug yourself in where you fit. Maybe you have Aries and Gemini heavy in your chart too, investigator person. If you do, you could have Aries or Gemini in your sun, moon, rising, Venus, or Femme, Midhaven, or Jupiter. I didn't hear if you were masculine or femme. So you plug it in how it resonates, okay? However, that resonates for you. The secret plan of the past involved a lot of lies and hidden cameras. The secret plan of the past involved a lot of lies and hidden cameras is what I heard. So maybe it was hidden cameras in a home or some kind of structure or some shape, form, or fashion or pulling house. So the um secret plan shifty secret plan of the past involved a uh, home and a lot of hidden cameras um so yeah um wow this does remind me of secret seven but you plug it in how it resonates but now these people are in poverty because um they can't do what they used to do which was voyeur off of people make money off people feed off people um um make other people's lives hell because 
for their pocketbooks, basically. This is terrible. Um, but now that they're not making, at least one person in this mix was, was making it good money off this shit, but now they can't. The one that's now having to sell their body, well, they don't have to, but it sounds like they're being blackmailed to sell their body out to these people. And one of them they're selling their body out to is an officer of the law. Um, but but one person, at least in the universe, is on to them. I think it might be you, person. Um, you're on to this situation. Um, investigating it. I think uh, you're on to it, whoever you are. Um, whether you watch my channel or not, I'm not sure. Um but I think you've been seeing the economic status change of these people is what I'm thinking. I think you've been seeing the economic status change of these people. And maybe that's why you started following or investigating this person. And you started realizing they, they've been doing this or about to realize it. However, this resonates. You plug it in how it resonates. Let me see if I hear anything else. These, this person that does secret services for these masculine energies, they've had a long, 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 long history of crime. Someone is about to really, really, really start heavily investigating this person. They're about to find a lot out about this person on the street side in a negative sense. About to build a huge case against them pedophile, pervert, thief, abuser, exploiter. Oh my gosh. So you plug it in how it resonates. Wow. Holy crap. So you're significant in here too, investigative person. Now for some, it could be a group of you guys investigating, but I'm pulling in at least one investigative person. So you plug yourself in where you fit. You could be this person, this person, this person, or this person, or a group of you guys. However that resonates, you plug it in how it resonates. But I heard um, basically something has alerted either one person or a group of you guys to start investigating this person. That's basically selling their body out for like gay for play s type energy i mean i just don't know how else to say it that's basically what it is um gay for pay slash pay play type energy i mean I'm, I'm serious i just really don't know how else to say it but but you either one is on to this person or a group of you guys however that resonates but how that resonates you're on to them but it sounds like you're about to do a full-on investigation of this person of the past and um I heard you're about to find out a lot, a lot. I heard pedophile energy, child abuse, exploitation, th theft. I mean, all I hear is charge after charge after charge after charge. I mean, this person, I heard they've been a criminal it's out the street side for a long ass time, but it sounds like they have not been caught yet. Um, but it sounds like you're on to them. And it sounds like you're about, I heard you're about to build a huge case against them. So, I think you're a very high vibrational person or group, however that resonates. I heard person, but you know, it, you could incorporate a group into this possibly because it sounds like it's going to be huge. Um, you plug it in, how it resonates. Wow. I mean, these are some nasty, nasty, nasty things. Pedophilia, um, child abuse, theft, exploitation. I mean, it's that's sickening. That's sickening. Um, and honestly, if I'm kind of relating it to secret seven, I didn't hear secret seven in here, but it reminds me of secret seven because the, all that was involved in the secret seven S type energy. It just really was. Um, it was, um, I heard Aries and Gemini energy in here. So there's, um, at least one Gemini masculine energy in here, one Aries masculine energy. You could be an Aries or a Gemini investigator or investigators, possibly, but 
at least one Aries Gemini person with those in their chart in here. So you plug it in how it resonates. All right, I love you guys so much. Everybody make wonderful choices and namaste.